model turned designer Tori Praver was ahead of the game when she launched her eponymous swimwear line. Myself being a bikini model was definitely a little advantage, just the fact that I've been able to experience the fashion industry firsthand and, and know what people like and what people look for. The inspiration for this collection was deserts and sunsets and even Africa. It was really based on natural tones and real earthy colors like olive green and a, a really deep ocean blue and the colors from the sunset. I have two different stories for the collection. I think they go together, but at the same time, the colors that I've pulled from each being inspiration, the earth tones from the desert and the shocking neons from the sunset. This is um, the olive green that I was referring to as well. It's, it's a new color and I just feel like it's so rich. This is the Luna, this is new. I did a bikini with fringe and also a full piece, and this is just fun and just reminds me of summer, and I, I love it. I love this suit. This is one of my favorite colors. This is called Merlot. This is actually a color that we brought back from resort last year because it's just so beautiful. This is the Shyla in Merlot, and it has the braiding. I think it, these, these straps on the side are just you know, a really sexy touch. You can, you know, put them together. I like them spread apart so you can kind of see that there's so many straps. This is a new color. This is a really pretty deep blue that reminds me of the ocean and like the color of the water in Hawaii where I'm from. Yeah, this is the hula top. This is um, actually the Nirvana floral that I brought back in two different colorways, this blue and also a neon version. And this is one of our most popular prints. This is the Kelly and this is the Mary Jane. These are um, both really popular and they're in my new neons. This is a uh, watermelon and I, we call this Fanta. And then this is the neon floral that Sam's actually trying on. This actually looks like a, a bikini from the back and then from the front it's cut out and I guess the proper word is a monokini. It kind of defeats the purpose of a full piece but it's still really sexy if you want to have some coverage. This isn't one of the surfing suits. This is a suit that you wear to lay out or you know wear under a cover up or lay by the pool. This is the Raven. It's new to this collection and it's in the, she's wearing the, the native print and it shows the new neon colors and solids as well as, as a new print that's been really popular. It has a halter neck and the cut outsides I think are just really different and really fun. So the ruching detail is my signature. That's what I'm known for. I think it really makes a suit fit well and form to the body and it's really something unique and, and something that I'm proud of. This is the Betty bottom. This is one of my favorite. I think that I was really inspired by the Gidget era. I love that like vintage feel. I design things that I want to wear, really, and I and I love just to put on like a pair of little light shorts or pants after the beach. These are new to the collection. I have shorts and pants version. We um, have a few new styles of the modal cotton fabric, and then I actually injected some gauzy cover-ups as well. I really, really take pride in the fact that everyone can find one of my suits that fit them. It's really versatile and, you know, any age group can wear them. My grandma has a suit and my mom wears my bikinis and, and all my girlfriends under my age wear, wear them. And I also sell a separate, so depending on, you know, you, you may be larger on top than the bottom or vice versa and my suits allow you to kind of pick what sizes fit your body best. Tori also designed suits for the tiniest bodies of all. I actually have quite a few friends at home in Hawaii that have kids and they always have asked me, when are you going to do baby suits? We want to see baby suits. So this is the cakey line we, we started th this year. Well, I feel like for, for babies, you don't want to be in anything that's too hard or, or dark. The baby paint, this little ditzy floral print and the light pastels. So I think it'll be pretty cute someday to see a mom and daughter duo wearing my suits.